Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Henry Prasetyo and here I will show you how to make a render texture, a layer for your camera, render it separately from other objects and yeah just like that. So what we gonna do here is we gonna make a 3D glass. I mean like like a binocular or a night vision googles just like that and the glass will render a different object from a different layer they will only render a specific object on your skin with a specific layers so here for like here for example uh let's just start it we have I have a character here, a 3D character, and there's no camera and on the skin. Let's create one. We have camera here, 3D camera, a perspective camera, and align it with this. So here, by default, this camera will render all object in the skin, all layers. The cooling mask, they render everything in the skin. And by default, our object is set to the default layer here. We can add more layers here, add more layers, so I'm going to... I'm gonna add my layers, name it glass only, and then, so create another camera, just duplicate it, and then make a child of the first camera, name it glass camera. So here for example, I will make a night vision googles or more infrared camera so here cooling mask make it to nothing and set it into glass only click it and after that we need to make um, our object set into glass layer so here I have my character duplicated and I'm gonna make another material for another character for my second character and name it just uh, hit, hit material and we'll just we're just gonna make it Emission, emission light, they will emit a uh, color, just like that. Make it more like blue. Or make it more like green, or uh, whatever you want. We'll just make it like this. And just drag and drop it into your objects to apply them to a mesh render just like that and set it into glass only layer click it and yes change children click it and then glass on the layer will render will render a glass object a, uh, an object that set into glass only layer so here for example if I disable the glass camera they render both character so on the first camera you set the calling max and 
uncheck the glass only. Yeah. Here, let's make it in the same position. Set in the same position. Paste value. And here, if you expect that. And after that, we're gonna make. Hmm. A 3D glasses. A 3D object. Make it make a 3D object and we'll make a quad object. And we'll drag it into our camera here. And yeah, I forget to make a render render texture. So make a render texture. Click on it. Click click. And yeah. Name it glass texture. Glass screen. And on the glass camera, you drag and drop the glass screen uh, render texture into your target textures. Drag and drop like that. And yeah. And now if we enable the glass camera. Now it will not render the second character invisible. So to make it visible, we we're gonna make it visible with glass camera. I mean glass glass screen. Yeah. So here's name it glass screen. Set the position and the rotation and this glass screen make another material name it glass screen materials and apply them to your glass screen and this set the oops 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 Set the albedo texture into your render texture, something like this. Yeah. Oops, I uh, forget. Don't use on albedo map, but on on the emissions. That make a lot more. Sh that makes sense. Okay. No. 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 Don't use emission map. Uh, we'll let's just change our shutter into unlit texture and then apply our render texture into base map like that and here we go Align it. Need to adjust the camera positions. There we go. That's nice. Okay. Let's make. So yeah, this is. This is how it's done. The camera will only render a specific layers on the skin with a specific object. Okay, that's all. Um, thank you for watching. If you have any question, please leave it on the comment box below here on this video. And please subscribe if you want a more Unity tutorial. Please like if you like this video and share it if you found this tutorial useful.